Hi, I am Ram Gopal from PresentationProcess.com. In this video, you will learn how to use PowerPoint guides to align objects. Let us say you have two pictures at different positions on two different slides. For example, you have this picture on in this position in the slide and the same picture is in some other position on the next slide. You want both the pictures to be at the same position on both the slides. How do you achieve that? Now let us go to the earlier picture and let us say that this is the position that we are aiming for and we want all the other pictures to be in the exact same place. We can do that by using guides. So I'm going to right click and go to the option called grid and guides and click on the small arrow here to the right and that will open up this flyout menu and I can click on the option called guides. Now you have these two guides available to you immediately which are uh, these dotted lines. When you move your cursor on the dotted line it will turn into this double headed arrow. You can use that to move the guide to the position you want. Now I'm going to make sure that the guides align with the top left corner of the photo. So I'm going to place my cursor on the horizontal guide and I'm going to move in such a way that, that both the guides intersect at the top left corner of the photo. Now let us go to the next slide and you can see that the photo is off. So I'm going to click on the photo and I'm going to make sure that the top left corner of this photo aligns with the intersection. Now, when I go to slideshow mode and go to the previous uh, slide here and go to the slideshow mode, this photo and the next photo are exactly in the same position. So that is how you align photos properly slide after slide using the power of guides. And as you observe, you don't have the guides visible here in the slideshow mode. And if you don't want to see the guides, then all you need to do is to right click, go to grid and guides once again and check this option called guides. And this will, this check mark will go away and you will not see guides on your slides. Now, what you saw was just one example of how to use one of the tools in PowerPoint. If you want to master PowerPoint in a structured way, then I highly recommend you join Ram Gopal's PowerPoint Mastery Membership Program. It is arguably the most creative and comprehensive PowerPoint training online with over 650 step-by-step -step video tutorials, more than 225 text-based lessons, and more than 400 downloadable files available to you instantly on joining the membership program. This program can change the way you create your presentations forever. And one more thing, if you are someone who is interested in making your PowerPoint slides creative, then please join our free snackable PowerPoint course. It is a useful email course with 10 super short emails with step-by-step -step video tutorials that teach you creative techniques that you can use in your next presentation. You can join the email course instantly by clicking on the link here. Thanks a lot for watching this video. I'll see you in the next video.